Hey, this is Digital Byte Computing. We're gonna review the Intel NUC. Awesome little Intel NUC computer. It is one of the smallest computers you can get out on the market. They're super cool, super compact, very powerful for what they are. Um, we have got an i7 Intel NUC, so let's go through the basic features, the functionality. So here is the unit. This is the Intel NUC. Uh, 5i7ryh. So this is the i7 unit of the Intel NUC. Has uh, multiple features, multiple ports available. Very small unit. If I just use my hand as an example, quite easily just pick up the entire unit. Um, really, really isn't too big. I mean, if we look at a little screwdriver, here's a tiny screwdriver. You've got a big screwdriver. All right, so the unit is extremely tiny, extremely compact. Um, now, this unit comes in a kit. So a lot of the time when you do buy it, it does come empty. Um, when I say empty, it comes with the processor, but it won't come with any RAM or your hard drive. Um, you can go ahead and buy that separately. It will generally be cheaper for you to buy it separately than to buy it together with the unit. So this particular unit is the fifth generation uh, Intel Core i7. Uh, it comes up to um, 3.1, up to 3.4 gigahertz, etc. cetera. Uh, it can take dual channel DDR3 RAM. It's running Sodiums, which is the smaller laptop size RAM units as well, which we're gonna look at in the, at the moment. Comes with your uh, Iris Graphics 6100, uh, and it's got some other ports and features as well. Top of the unit just has your standard power button. Now the unit also does come with a wireless AC adapter, so it lets you plug into your wireless um, network as well. You've got a couple of USBs, all right? And you've also got your headphone jack there as well. So the headphone jack is a 7.1 surround sound. And on the front, you've got two USB 3 ports. One of them will be charging capable as well, which is great. You've got your power, your display port ports, right? So this is the mini display port, which uh, was pioneered a little while ago. So you can run that directly into a screen. You can you know, get an adapter to run that into a, uh, a DVI or into HDMI. You've then next got a gigabit ethernet which lets you run into your network points. You've got a couple more USB 3 um, ports, and then you've got a smaller form factor HDMI, which is essentially a mini HDMI. So a normal HDMI cable will not run into this. You need to get an adapter from the bigger to the smaller HDMI port to be able to run that into the screen. So you've essentially got two display outs, four USBs, two on the back, two on the front, your gigabit ethernet as well. So the bottom of the unit, you've got four screws that you can unscrew to actually open the unit up and insert your parts, take out existing parts and change things around. So the inside of your Intel NUC, it has a couple of RAM slots. All right, so there's sodium RAM, which is inserted into your Intel NUC. And you've also got the case, which is the bottom, right? So this is the bottom here. Is a lot of the time you'll buy these, it doesn't come with this hard drive and it won't come with any RAM. So you can buy that separately and insert it in. It's generally cheaper to do that yourself and insert it in. All right, so this is the RAM that's in there. So the hard drive is a standard two and a half inch all right, which is the same size that you'll have inside of your laptops uh, and your more modern computers. Uh, can run a standard uh, SATA hard drive, which is your normal ones, which are, you know, with the moving parts and the disks and what have you, the, the, the needle. Or you can run a SSD, which is what this has got, um, which is a solid state disk. It's flash based, uh, so it's gonna be a lot quicker. You've also got your RAM, couple of RAM slots. These are DDR3, as I mentioned before and it's up to 16 gig maximum. So this is two eight gig sticks, up to 16 gig in total for your 
Intel NUT. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like it and subscribe to Digital Byte Computing for a whole bunch of more videos.